Hi, I'm Mariana Curto, PhD at the Barcelona Institute for Global Health, and I'm excited to tell you about our new study recently published in Epidemiology. The aim of our study was to examine the associations between long-term levels of PM2.5 and black carbon with systolic and diastolic blood pressure in India. To do so, we used cross-sectional data from 5,500 adults from the Andhra Pradesh Children's and Parents Study, which is a large intergenerational cohort in South India. We assess air pollution using uh, the land use regression estimates at residents obtained within the CHAI project, which is an European-funded project led by Catherine Tona, the senior author of this study. Participants resided in 28 peri-urban villages and blood pressure measurements were done at one point in time in the clinics from these study villages. Based on these measurements, we identified 46% of participants as hypertensive. Our main conclusion is that we observe a positive association between long-term residential exposure to PN2.5 and systolic blood pressure in women, but not in men. This association was independent of the type of fuel used for cooking and was up to 10 times higher than previous estimates found in China. Exposure to black carbon was not associated with low pressure either in men or in women. Our study sheds light on the relationship between particle exposure and cardiovascular health in areas not dominated by traffic, which have received far less attention in literature if compared with areas dominated by traffic. Our study also overcomes several limitations uh, of previous studies, such as the use of land use regression estimates to assess air pollution more accurately. And the main limitation of our study is that it's cross-sectional, so we could not uh, ensure that exposure precedes the outcome. Additional epidemiological evidence uh, is therefore needed to corroborate our findings, ideally from studies using longitudinal data. If you want to know more about our study, uh, we invite you to check it out and thanks for listening.